There's a polishing kit available to polish the working electrode with. And in the kit, you'll get the fine and coarse polishing compound, some discs to do the polishing on, and a set of instructions. You'll also need some deionized water and a beaker. <clears throat> so to get it polished, first of all, we need to disassemble the cell. And to do that, we're going to remove the yoke knob and take the working electrode off. And I'll put the cell out of the way. And then I'm going to show you with a fine compound. I'm going to put a small amount of compound of the, the powder into the center and add some deionized water to it with a wash bottle. And that's going to form a paste. And what we're going to do then is just polish for around five minutes. And so it's good to polish in a figure of eight like this. And we would do this for about five minutes and that's going to polish the electrode. Now, normally you should only use to, need to use the white compound, um, which is the finer one. If things are very badly fouled and the peak shapes are very small, you can use the coarse. But in actual fact, day to day, you may find that you don't need to use either compound at all. You can just use the eraser, um, which I'll talk about in a second. So we'll obviously polish for longer than that normally. And it's of course important to rinse off the electrode afterwards. So we're going to take our beaker and use the wash bottle to rinse off the compound. And what we'll also do is put some deionized water onto the pad, onto a different location, and we'll use it to clean it off there as well. So we're, we're sort of removing the compound from it this way as well. And then we'll kind of repeat that process and rinse it off. 